Hey guys, Paranoia here. Welcome back to my Let's Play of Amnesia, A Machine for Pigs. I am doing a face cam for this gameplay, so make sure to subscribe, give a like, holla at me if you like it. You know how it goes. So we're continuing on, making our way to what seems like the innards of the factory. And the phone's ringing again. Who the fuck is calling me? Anywho, I've got another journal entry, looks like. The factory offices. Oh, there we go. That's where we are. All the suggestions of a large workforce, yet no actual signs of life. It is every bit as if someone has attempted to carefully create the illusion of a working factory complex. Yet this facade, uh, when examined closely, facade, when examined closely, is clearly just a falsification. But I must put aside my anxieties, quell the unease that pits my stomach, and continue on my path. It's my first attempt at narrating a uh, let's play. And I think the nervousness is getting to me a little bit. Bear with me as I get used to this. It's a lovely painting. What a good choice of music to be nice and scary, right? So what do you guys think so far? You thoroughly enjoying it? We've got a note. October 11th, 1899. So it looks like a year uh, or so from the last note we found in the house. Uh, we integrate the very latest knowledge of chemistry using low levels of laud laudanum, 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 derivative and feed to subdue the product even before the initiation of the process. This means that when we drag them from holding pens onto the line, they are less likely to panic and damage machine components, other products, or themselves. This section of the belt is sheathed in rubber and kept well lit to maintain good spirits, and we have actually found that the intelligent placement of gramophones and simple acoustic amplification tubes around the line means we can use music to further soothe the product. We find Debussy particularly effective in this regard. Debussy? I'm guessing it's the name of one of the pigs? I don't, I don't know. So, they're definitely treating the animals like, you know, product. And it looks like they're finding ways to, uh, make them more complacent, I guess. Warning! Fueling pumps! Volatile chemicals are in use. These materials are highly corrosive. Wear protection. Wear protection! Got a lantern. Is that good enough? Door is locked. There. Now we're getting some piggies. Oink, 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 oink. Entry. Pumping station. It appears to be some kind of fueling station. I have seen automobiles demonstrated at Mr. Yarum and Mr. Simmons' works, but the smell here is all wrong. This is not petroleum. Of that I am sure. Everything suggests to me that this machine must be significant in some way. Another entry? No. Nice. Oh, that's that's wonderful. I couldn't play with it. Enough of that. Nice. 
nice. Open nice for me, isn't it? Uh, don't want to get scared. I don't want to get scared. Strangers not allowed on this works. Inquiries to be made at the lodge. some reason I wonder why that's significant why I'm able to open this door there's gotta be a reason let's open it right up I'm running for my fucking life. <laughs> That's how I'll escape. What? Okay, it's the wind. Just the wind. Nothing scary about the wind. My heart is like, it's pounding like crazy. Oh, note. I had a journal entry. Delivery schedule. How in blazes are we supposed to meet these damn schedules if even the basic equipment we are provided with simply will not perform its des designated function? These cursed new fangled trucks will only run a fraction of the distance my old nag managed before running out of stinking gasoline. The gaffer says it's fine, and there's plenty of pumps to refill them outside the factory walls, but you end up dragging a blessed tank from the truck to the nearest one to refill it, and the one in the storeroom is empty again. I can't be turning that crank handle all day only to find the tank is empty. Well, sod it, says. I, enough for a night, and to my bed I go. It's not like anyone needs access to the bleeding graveyard anyway. Harry, if you get this, I'll meet you in the Damson Templar for a jar. Sounds like someone's snapping. Holy orders. This church is connected to the plants. How odd. However, it does suggest another route into the main part of the facility, given the locked doors around the fueling station. The truck blocks my way, however, almost as if the saboteur knew that I might consider this alternative entrance. Cool. So it's as if whatever this guy was doing, he just up and left and you know, never came back. It makes me wonder if, like, I'm, I'm dead, you know, and I'm just kind of wandering around. Come on, Papa. Let's climb this one. I can see more pictures at the top. The truck needs to be moved, I guess. And the letter said I can't be cranking this all damn day. So I'm wondering if... Anything else? Let's go forward and see what else is around here. Because that, that graveyard gate looks like it opens, but I can't get into it without moving the truck. My lands are going out. Ooh. 
This looks like some kind of block for the truck. Let's see what the journal says. Uh, a strange container. This canister looks as if it may fit the fuel pump I saw earlier. It certainly carries the same fatigued, unholy reek. I will not think of that which I saw pass me in its cage. I will not gaze again into that dark machine room. A more immediate task presents itself, and the opportunity perhaps to gain access to St. Dunstan's. I didn't see anything in that room, but I saw this pretty quickly, so let's go look. Let's go see what's in here. I don't see anything. What do you guys see? Locked. Huh, I don't know. Why do I hear music scary again? <laughs> what is that doing there? That wasn't there before. <sighs> oh. This fucking pig, I, this, oh, it's like a mask. Cool. Is there anything more I have to do? You know what I gotta do? I'm, yeah. This is a, a tank. We have to put some gas in this shit. Yeah, here we go. I actually uh, tried looking it up, but there's nothing. No one's really played it too much yet. Boom. Filling up the gas tank, figuring things out. What? Up, let's get out of here. I'm scared. There's a pig. He's coming to get me. Hurry up. Hurry up. Holy shit. That was awesome. Ta-da! Ta-da! Making sure my shit's still recording. <laughs> Alright. Jeez. Caught me off guard a little bit. And we did it! Awesome. Alright. Let's carry on. This way, Papa. Come and see. Will it hatch? Can we take it home? What yes, hatch? Papa. Of course we can take it home. I mentioned a stone egg earlier. Now, why would there be a cemetery near a factory?
think I can hear babies crying. Or people screaming. Huh. Livestock and Bibles. Alright guys, we figured out the whole truck thing. So I hope it's at least helpful or you're having fun watching. It's pretty cool so far. I'm starting to get the feels for the game. So yeah, I'll end it here and tune in next time.